The space hopper was invented by Aquilino Casani of Ledragoma, an Italian company that manufactured toy rubber balls, although it also shows as being patented around the same time in the UK by Reg Barnett and John Orne. Casani patented the idea in Italy in 1968 and then the United States in 1971 and called the toy Ponpon. Space hoppers were introduced in the UK in 1969. The Cambridge Evening News newspaper in England contained an advertisement for the hopper in November of that year and described it as a trend. The space hopper became a major craze for several years and remained widely popular throughout the 1980s. They're sometimes considered the symbol of the 1970s. The space hopper was a pure toy. The rider couldn't go any faster than walking pace or any higher than a small hop. The original UK space hopper was manufactured by Metoy. Wembley made a similar model which had smooth handles rather than the ribbed original ones. In the UK, the orange kangaroo design is now available in adult size versions. In the US, the first mass marketed hopping ball was the Hoppity Hop, released by the Sun Company around 1968. Because of the market and media saturation by this toy, any such ball, regardless of its origin, is now generally known in the US by that name, or sometimes Hippity Hop. The earliest Hoppity Hops were made of rubber, usually red or blue, with a round ring handle on top and an automatic tyre valve for inflation. In the 1970s, Sun introduced various character versions of the Hoppity Hop, such as the Hoppity Horse, Disney's Mickey Mouse and Donald Duck, with hard plastic versions of the character's head attached to the ball. The Hoppity Hop sold steadily for decades, but by the 1990s sales apparently started to slip due to increased competition from foreign hoppers. At some point the Hoppity Hop came to be made of a vinyl-like material, some moulded in fluorescent colours. According to advertising materials, the Hoppity Hop's original targets were both adults and children. Since the balls only inflated to around 20 inches, however, it's doubtful that any but the shortest adults could have got much use out of one. Today, numerous versions can be found in most stores, ranging anywhere from 16 to 24 inches. The European hop balls appeared in the beginning of the 1990s and are still available. Made by Italy's Ledragoma, these are essentially a quality exercise ball with a handle attached. The sizes of these balls range from the Hop 45 to the Hop 66. While it's still used for fun and exercise by many adults, the Hop 66 is still borderline child sized. Space hoppers can be seen used in the background of one scene of episode 59 of the original Star Trek series and one episode of the popular 70s British comedy The Goodies was mostly related to space hoppers. The plot of the episode called Charity Bounce involved a charity bounce on space hoppers from London to Brighton. The space hopper lent its name and face to the Birmingham psychedelic trance parties that ran from the mid-1990s to 2000 and also appeared at the Glastonbury Festival. In a season 7 episode of Friends, Phoebe bounced for one mile on a hippity hop, this being on a bucket list of things she had to do before she turned 30. If you like these videos and want to see more, then feel free to subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.